Hi, my name is Rich. I was a patient at Gaylord in uh, September and October of 2006. I dehydrated from some medication that I was on and passed out in my bathroom at home, compressing my spinal cord, paralyzing me from my neck down. I landed in the hospital for spinal cord surgery and the doctor told my family that I would probably never walk again and spend the rest of my life in a wheelchair. Uh, the representatives from Gaylord came and assessed my situation and me, asked me questions, and uh, thought that they were would be able to help me. After, uh, I think, about eight days at Yale Haven, I was transferred to Gaylord. The nurses at the hospital said that was the best place for me. If I could be helped, that was the place that could help me. They highly recommended it, thought it was wonderful that I was going there. And I thought to myself, I don't know why, if I'm never going to walk again, why should I go anywhere? But they encouraged me and when I got to Gaylord uh, it was just wonderful. I, I, the nurses and the therapists uh, all encouraged me, although the only thing I could move was a big toe, but uh, within a week or so uh, I was able to move my thumb and they thought that was wonderful and that told them that there was probably going to be more movement and that I was able, going to be able to walk. Um, I wouldn't get 100% of my uh, movement back, but they felt that I would have some ability to to use my arms and legs again. I still didn't think so and I wasn't necessarily uh, thrilled about this, but I finally decided to go along with them, join the program, be happy about it because they were so encouraging and I have to say that they were just wonderful. Uh, the first time they asked me to get up and walk, I said, you've got to be kidding. Uh, you know, it's like learning all over again as a baby and they said it would be baby steps and baby uh, you know, to be very patient, and it, it, it took a lot of patience. If nothing else, I learned patience for sure. Um, the, the occupational and physical therapists were wonderful. They were very encouraging. We had a little fun while I was in there, too, uh, a few jokes. Um, the nurses were wonderful. Um, it's just it's a fantastic place. They, they got me to where I am now. I walked out of there without a cane, without a walker, um, with no support uh, at all. Uh, the only support I had was, was uh, support from them. Um, emotional support was wonderful, 100% emotional support from both the nursing staff and the, and the um, physical and occupational therapists. I still go back there now. I go and do some uh, volunteer work. Uh, I go back to visit patients who were in the same situation as I was. Uh, uh, they will call me in and ask me if I will go visit them and tell them my experiences and how it is. And, uh, it doesn't happen overnight. Even when I left there, uh, I still needed therapy. I went back to Gaylord. There were a lot of places I could go. There were uh, um, other Gaylord offices I could have gone to. Um, I wanted to go back to Wallingford, and I went back to outpatient therapy at Wallingford for, oh, probably a good eight, nine months um, after that, because they were just as good. The outpatient therapy was just as wonderful as the inpatient therapy. I still go back there um, to visit and uh, I would recommend it to anybody who needs therapy. It's a fantastic place.